Well, hello guys and dolls. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a fantastic hump day. My day started just magnificent. I woke up this morning and my husband went downstairs to get some medicine for his migraines. He suffers from migraines. And he calls upstairs and he says, Cheryl. And I said, yeah, babe. He says, where is your car? What do you mean, where is my car? Your car is not out here. I'm thinking, you have got to be kidding me. So, we had the wonderful uh, <laughs> day of waking up with our car stolen. So, anyway, such is life. Let's get on with the show. <laughs> All right. So, um, a few days ago, I did a review for you on a wig from a company called It's a Wig. And the name of the wig was Lace Manhattan. And so I told you I would come back and do an update. And so this is Lace Manhattan with six inches cut off. And I left it looking just like this so you can see what it looks like. Okay, first of all, let's talk about the positive things about this wig. The cap construction is fabulous. The lace was soft. It was very realistic. The hairline, gorgeous. The hair color, beautiful. However, the tag said it does not tangle. Boy, they must have been talking about another wig. Because this wig, as you can see, is about as tangled as they get. I would say each hair has its own route. It has a mind of its own. It goes where it wants to. As you can see, it is very tangled. Uh, not only that, the hair separates from from one another, if, if you understand what I mean. You can see these little things sticking out and they have separated from the hair. So the hair is not one. Um, in the top of the wig, <clears throat> these little, what is that? These little short hairs, see them sticking up? Now that is in the cap construction. Little short hairs sticking straight up. And I didn't cut them off because I want you to see them. And they're all in the top of the wig. I'm not going to pull it all loose and everything. But, okay. That's the curl pattern. So I have to spray some on that. <clears throat> and then cut these. I'm going to have to go through cut these little hairs off that are sticking up with a mind of their own. All right. Hair is very soft. Very soft. After I wore this wig for a day and a half, it was a tangled mess. So, what I finally did, first I put some uh, moisturizing curl activator on it to smooth the cuticles of the hair down. The next day, it was a mess again. What I finally put on this hair to get it to kind of come together as one and tame it, was good old-fashioned hair oil. <laughs> um, I was trying to see if I... I thought I had the container in here, but I do, I do not. It is a soft tea argon uh, oil. It comes in a little jar. And I put that on it. I, I had to separate it and put it on a few strands at a time to get them to come together uh, and I have my wide tooth comb here and I just want to show you a little bit of what I mean <laughs> you can't even get this through you can't even get it through there and when you comb it or not comb it even when you finger wave uh, I'm sorry finger comb this hair I got knots in it. 
uh, and I had to go through with the scissors and cut the knot out before I could get the comb through it. So I've worn this hair today. I have not combed it out. I will comb it out and apply some moisturizer tonight when I go to bed so that it will be ready for me to wear tomorrow. I'm going to get at least a week's wear out of this wig before I put it in the wig cemetery because that's where it belongs. Now, if you can deal with these issues in this wig and go with the positives, you know you're going to have to comb this out, you're going to have to moisturize it, and uh, go through and cut all the little wispies off this, that are sticking up on their own and style it. Wig is beautiful. Wig is beautiful. But it is n by no means tangle free. So, to get like this hair here to stay together like that, that's from grease. What we <laughs> call hair grease. Whether you want to use some heavy bergamot or whatever kind of hair grease you want to put on there, that's what's going to hold these hairs together and keep them from flying away. What it is, the hair flies away from uh, each other, if that's how I can put it. So, I'm going to go through and doctor on it and get it ready for tomorrow. But that is the update on It's a Wig, Lace Manhattan. All right, ladies, have a great day. Bye-bye.